It was business as usual for Rory McIlroy and CBS Sports reporter Amanda Balionis on Sunday. Days after the Daily Mail reported how the two were the talk of the links following the Northern Irishman's divorce from wife Erica Stoll, McElroy and Balionis were all smiles during an interview at the RBC Canadian Open. McElroy, who filed for divorce from Stoll in May after seven years of marriage, finished the tournament tied for fourth at 13 under. Balionis previously had the internet stirring in February when she appeared without her wedding ring. Despite being married to former North Carolina quarterback Bryce Renner. Explore more. With McElroy now single and the uncertainty surrounding Baliona status, rumors have circulated of the two potentially being an item. Us Weekly shot down the buzz, though, with the source stating McElroy and Balionis have just a professional relationship. They had appeared quite friendly with one another during previous interviews. McElroy also filmed an advertisement for the puppies and in golf, which helps dogs in need. The two reportedly have just a professional relationship. At Tormus X, all the rumors and drama would have provided plenty of reason for the two to avoid a sit-down interview during the latest tournament, but they proceeded as usual. McElroy shot a 6-under 64 in the final round Sunday to put him at a total of 13-under. Robert McIntyre would go on to win his first PGA Tour event at 16 under. Balionis asked McElroy about whether he thought he may win. I don't think so, McElroy said, per the Daily Mail. I wish it was. I had a couple of good opportunities on the way in. Selfishly, it would nice if it was enough. But Bob is a good friend of mine, a Ryder Cup teammate, and it would be really good to see him get the job done. Neither McElroy nor Balionis have publicly commented on the rumors, and McElroy has offered very little about his divorce. His manager, Sean Offlaherty, issued a statement in the wake of the bombshell split. As McElroy's camp stressed, Rory's desire to ensure this difficult time is as respectful and amicable as possible.